Hello everyone. So it's been about a month ever since I talked about this topic about 2016 hitting a woman back to Mexico. So for this today's topic, I'm, the image I'm showing you is being so 6216. Now, why this locomotive? Well, it's because back in April 21st, 2024, this locomotive was involved in derailment in Bennett, Nebraska, just for a YouTube video. Yes, you heard me right. So here's the story. So 6216 was in charge of a coal train, which the locomotive was leading, was entering the state of Nebraska, and upon getting ready to pass by a crossing near a rail enthusiast, it went over the switch and crashed into the coal car, causing the locomotive, along the 20 unit SC78805, along a few of the coal cars to derail. Now, if you don't believe me, well, here's the footage. Freaking God! Yeah. Right after that, he decided to upload the video he caught onto YouTube, in which he has a YouTube channel that goes by the name of Cavity City Rail Productions. But once he uploaded the video, he was suddenly being blamed for for causing the train to derail. And in fact, there's been many YouTube channels such as History in the Dark, for example, uploaded so many videos about this topic about this teenager during the train just reviews. And in fact, his video actually made it to the news. But how do we know that this teenager caused the derailment? Well, what he didn't know is there were security cameras right at the same place where the train derailed. After the law enforcement reviewed the security footage, they found the exact same teenager that recorded the video driven up to the switch, throwing the switch, and then set up the camera near the crossing just to film the train derailing. Well, as with this action, the Lancaster County Attorney's Office recommended that this teenager can be charged with felony criminal mischief. But, as we heard it from it, there's no signs of this teenager being charged or being found guilty for his actions. So yeah, at first I didn't mind about this, but ever since watching this recent video of History in the Dark talking about this topic, I suppose I can make something like this too. Now, hear me out. If you want to be a rail enthusiast, one thing for sure is you don't derail trains just for views. You can just like rail fan trains or I don't know, make documentaries like I'm doing right now or I don't know, go to a museum and see some antique rail equipment. And you know, there's many things you can do if you're a rail enthusiast. But one thing for sure, you don't derail a train, just reviews. So yeah, that's what the video I'm about to talk about today. And please don't be like that teenager, just please don't just rail fan trains, I don't know. Just do something that doesn't involve in derailing the train. So yeah, that's for what we're going to talk about for today, and if you have any more topics you want me to talk about, just send, just send it in the comments and then I'll talk about it. So yeah, that's what you're going to hear from me now, so I'll see you guys later.